Hello there guys. Uh, today I'm going to teach you guys how to install IIS, which stands for Internet Information Services and MySQL, so that you can go with stuff like WordPress, you know. Anyway, let's proceed. So first step is going to manage on the bottom uh, right corner, oh, upper right corner, I'm sorry. So you click on manage. Okay, system's a little slow, blame the RAM. I got only four for this instance, which is a problem. Windows Server is not meant to be run with just four gigs. I mean, you can, but it just doesn't, you know, it's kind of sluggish. Anyway, uh, before you, okay, that's, it doesn't matter. I mean, it does matter. You should read that, but I don't. Uh, here is where you select the server from the server pool. Which one do you want to install? to be the IIS. Uh, we just have one, so, you know, doesn't matter much. But if you have like different servers, you gotta decide which one do you wanna uh, to be like uh, the internet uh, server, you know? If you have like more than one, one for DHCP and Hyper-V and so on and so on. So here you click on IIS web server easy and add features bingo so next hmm now it's fully up to you i mean do you want to get more stuff you could get everything you could get just i'm gonna go with the very basics because well it's just for a tutorial anyway and it's uh it's a temporary instance on Google Pl Cloud Platform, so, you know. But, like, if you're running a proper server, I would recommend FTP server, stuff like that. And, uh, you know, it's up to you. Restart, restart, yeah, sure. Let's install. It takes around uh, three minutes, maybe a little less, depends on your computer. So, your mileage may vary. But usually it's pretty quick and then in the meantime I, I, I would recommend uh, uh, opening the browser and going to Microsoft platform oh shit I, I don't want it to be my default browser I don't care about that no uh, come on four gigs of RAM man uh, Microsoft platform installer so there you go and click on install no 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 default applications not now install this extension yes save and it's pretty damn quick it's Google Cloud after all I wouldn't recommend by the way if you need a Windows Server or a Linux instance running with excellent uptime and speeds and you know and it, with a lot of um, manageability go with Google Cloud it's amazing yeah I'll click on install and then it shows up permission screen you just proceed and there you go it's done uh, back to manager as you can see we got it installed IIS right there so you go here start menu which is blank for some reason oh there you go so it's gonna show IIS down there so click on it and here's your IIS so yeah first part is over <laughs> that was it IIS is up and running you can even uh, make sure by typing localhost and uh, come on there you go so IAS is working if it's a server with the uh, port uh, 80 open you can like go from a different browser on a different network and you can see this very same page which means that yeah, as a web server is operational but anyway uh, now open a web platform installer where magic happens where you can actually get more stuff for IAS not only MySQL but you could go with you know whatever you want so database that's what we want where's MySQL 
my skill will read you. There you are. So odd. Damn, it's, it's 2015. <laughs> it's the same version. Uh, for my first, for my first tutorial for 2012, it was the same version, dude. Come on, some things never change. Holy shit! So here's where you're gonna set up a password for the account. So yeah, it's up to you. Let's go with I love bacon, cause why not? I don't even love bacon, but you know I love bacon. Uh. Go on, MySQL. All right, I, I I accept that. It's gonna be a very fast download, cause Google Cloud Platform, my boys. Look at that. If only I had this internet. <laughs> Look at that. So damn quick. Anyway, now it's just a matter of waiting and waiting and waiting a little bit more. Hmm. Damn. All right, come on. I know you can do better than this, Windows Server. Come on, dude. Come on, please. Do that with me. There you go. There you go. So it's installed, and we have MySQL working. Uh, installed. So that's pretty much it. And you can even like go with apps if you wish. Like, why not go with WordPress? You know, it's probably outdated. Let me take a look at that. Um, yeah, we could go with Joomla. I don't even know if that's the right way to spell that, but, you know, there's a lot and lots, lots of options which you could choose from. Yeah, let's go with um, WordPress. But where's WordPress? It vanished. Come on. Word press you can do better than this come on yeah there you go it's actually pretty damn new excellent yeah wow look at his size damn okay i was oh yeah he has to install php as well and a few more features but yeah that was not even the point of <laughs> the whole uh tutorial but why not you know so mysql uh ias and uh wordpress because why not i mean if you want to host server and make your own website why not you go with wordpress which is a complete and open source cms which it's excellent for you know your personal blog or a news website or whatever you want to do, I mean, it's very flexible. I've been using uh, WordPress for years and no regrets. Not gonna lie, it's pretty damn good. So here's where you set up the things. Uh, application name, let's go with blog, because why not? Host name, nah, doesn't matter. Unique phrase. No you. Okay, uh, key. Okay. Okay. Damn it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me with this whole configuration thing. I, I just wanna install WordPress for God's sake. Damn. <laughs> I mean, of course, it should follow the steps if you're doing that for real, but it's not a point here. So, yeah. Wow. It closed. So, localhost slash blog. It's probably gonna show up WordPress. Come on. <laughs> uh, that was not even the point of the Ontario, so that doesn't matter much. You know. Uh, it's a little concerning, but that's probably because I, I forgot to install PHP. But the point of the whole tutorial was to teach you guys how to install IAS and MySQL, and we did that, so yeah. I think that's it my boys and girls uh, see you guys in the next one i hope i helped you guys with something and don't forget to leave a comment if you wish if you have any questions you know just feel free to leave a comment and i'll 
come I, I will respond as soon as I can. That's it. Bye.